Bardstown police say they found the remains back in these woods, along with a tent and several other items. Over the past year, we've not made any runs there. Major Joe Seely with Bardstown police says officers were responding to a call about a possible homeless camp. The call was, was that the residents could see the tent from the from the uh, assisted living facility. In the woods, they came across skeletal remains. At this point, we're not aware of any foul play, so we'll be running that as a death investigation. Seely says it is a man, but it's too early to tell who he is. Earl Wilson thinks he has an idea. Never bothered me. I never worried about anything. Wilson owns a small office a few hundred feet from the wooded area. He says he used to see a homeless man coming and going. Yeah, he would go go out in the mornings, go out on the street, you know, and then maybe about 4 o'clock in the afternoon, then he would come back and go back in the trees. And Wilson used to leave food for him, but says the man kept to himself. And sometimes I would go down to, to Kroger's or and buy, like, canned stuff that he wouldn't have to cook or anything, and it was just take them back there and set them, they disappeared. But he says it's now been several months since he last saw him. Then all of a sudden he just disappeared. Seely says until the state crime lab can positively identify the remains, they won't know who the man was. Denny Camper, WLKY News. And